you had happening as a result of the Second Intifada is that many Israelis reached exactly the opposite conclusion that they reached after the first. If after the first, for many Israelis, it was there's no political, there's no military solution for a conflict with the Palestinians, so we should look for diplomatic, negotiated political solutions. After the second intifada, Israel was able to quell the intifada with military solutions, with the fence and the wall. The wall's defense. What? The wall's defense. Yes. They're calling it defense. Maybe Palestinians. Me. Maybe Palestinians. Palestinians just want to go back to their houses. I've been to. May you may you be haunted with the images Sir. of the dismembered bodies of the children of Gaza. From the river to the sea, it's one state. It's their sure. land. They want to go back to their sure. houses. If you'd like to speak, we'd be happy to have you speak. Let Dr. Bill I just Baker, got back from Palestine. Let Dr. Bill make her presentation, and we'll be happy to call on you. Happy I've seen the children in the water in the camps. I've seen the swimming pools and the houses of the settlers over the land. They if want to go back to the houses of their grandparents who don't feet. solve the problem of anti-Semitism by making an apartheid state. Sir, it's, it's just shameful. let her speak. <laughs> so, whether it was the fence, or the wall, or the re-incursion and reoccupation of the West Bank cities, or the building of an intelligence apparatus that was able to make sure that suicide bombings were known well before they made it into Israel's main city, it was military solutions that made it possible for Israelis, after the Second Intifada, to feel that they have security. And many Israelis, after that, have come to the exact opposite conclusion, saying there is a military solution, maybe not to the conflict, but to what we care about, which is having the basic security. Quiet. In fact, the last year was the most quiet year ever in Israel's history, the most secure one. It was the one in which people who have died as a result of the conflict, the number of people, was the lowest ever in the history of the conflict. And it was not the result of any negotiated solution, not the result of any diplomacy. All security, defense, military, and intelligence solutions. So suddenly you have a vast majority of Israelis who find themselves in a very different place than they were 10 or 15 years ago. Moreover, this has done something to Israel's political map. If in the 90s, the 70s, the 80s, the left in Israel, the Labour Party, other parties to the left of labor were certain, convinced that the solution to the conflict with the Palestinians was the, the creation of a Palestinian state in the West Bank of Gaza. What happened in the last decade is that many people on that left have moved from becoming a certain left to becoming a skeptical left. What does it mean that it's a
sure that future partition is necessary. That makes us less. Apartheid. What makes us skeptical? Sir, please. What makes us skeptical? relations with an apartheid state at one of the best top universities in the country. are no longer sure that this 